no I did not change my outfit from the last video because it's really cute I wish I had somebody who could do like a full body record because it's a oh my head's itching oh that feels amazing I like this wig because I can like get through and get the itch on. This hair is from Sway Hair. It is an old wig, y'all, that I put some um, conditioner in today. I washed it and it's giving me life. I'm going out in a few. I'm going to my friend's birthday party tonight in New York City. Um, you guys know I'm still in New York, right? My last video link will be right here on this makeup look. Um, I'm in New York City. But I wanted to come and show you guys the lipsticks that I travel with. Because I don't bring my whole collection when I'm traveling away from home. So I'm just going to show you guys some of the lipsticks that I do travel with. Some of my must-have lipsticks. So let's get right into it. I like this outfit, yeah. Ooh, I feel like a, I feel like a 80s sexy black. Ooh, melanin popping. All of that curly hair, big hair, don't care. So the first lipstick that I am wearing is by a company called Kitako. Kitako Cosmetics. I actually went with them to Paris and I taught two makeup classes in Paris with Kitako Cosmetics, okay? And the one that I'm wearing, it is called Ambrosia. That's a beautiful name, Ambrosia. And I have it on with chestnut lip liner. And then on top of that, I have on a pink lip gloss from Anastasia Beverly Hills called Peony. And then on top of that, why do I have on so much things on my lips? I don't know. But on top of that, I have on another lip gloss by Anastasia Beverly Hills called Sunset Strip. So this is what I'm wearing on my lips with a lip liner and the lip line that i'm wearing is by mac cosmetics and it's in chestnut baby yeah i know i love me some chestnut but it's almost finishing and excuse me i just burped and i think i'm gonna get some more chestnuts okay because my home girl about to hook me up you know so i'm gonna have to get some more chestnuts but this is like my go-to combination right here. Um, the lipstick, the liquid lipstick from Kitako Cosmetics is a mattifying lipstick. So then I add some gloss. I personally don't like nude matte lips on myself. I like my nudes to have some gloss to it. I personally find that glossy lip glosses, glossy nude lipsticks, or glossy nude, nude lipsticks, with gloss look really sexy to me it just looks like pouty and just you know what i mean so this is the next com this is the first combination and the next combination that i love especially because of the season guys is rebel from mac cosmetics like rebel from mac cosmetic guys I still love me a tube lipstick. I know that the new thing is liquid lipsticks. Everybody wants to wear liquid lipsticks. That's cool. But I still love me a tube. I'm sorry. And the Rebel um, lipstick from MAC Cosmetics, guys, this right here is a legend next to Ruby Woo. It's, you got to have Ruby Woo. You got to have Rebel. You got to have Diva. You got to have Snob. You got to have... Um, What's it called? Oh my God, it's my favorite. Viva Glam 2. Like those are some MAC lipsticks that you just have to have in your collection, okay? And when I'm traveling, I always travel with Rebel because if you have a simple makeup look, guys, and you put Rebel on, it looks so good. Let me show you guys what Rebel looks like. This is like my second two. And look how much product I have left. And I don't, you don't have to wear a lip liner with Rebel. I'm not gonna wear a lip liner. But if I were to wear a lip liner with Rebel, it would be which one? Night Moth. And this one is Rebel. Isn't Rebel cute, guys? Ugh. Okay, so I'm not at home, so it's really difficult for me to try and do close-ups and all that kind of stuff because my setup is quite different. I could have set up facing this black and white wall, but I set up earlier, so the, the window is behind this. So yeah, I really, really could have set up facing the black and white wall because 
my friend's apartment is so nice. It is so nice, but I didn't do that. Let me put my phone on. I'm signing. So this is Revel. Whenever I'm traveling, I always bring a Revel with me because I know it's a lipstick that I can just throw on and go. Another lipstick that I always carry with me, guys, they're actually called, they're actually two. It's called, um... Madison by Anastasia Beverly Hills and Rio by Anastasia Beverly Hills and I always travel with these two. This is like fun to me. Like it's it's the fun side of me when I'm traveling. It's like if I'm going to an event, if I want to be really bold, this is like the bold color, the fun side, the playful side. So let me show you guys what these two look like and I wear them together. So I take the darkest shade, which is called Madison. Then I'm gonna take Rio and put that in the center. So this is something more fun, more playful. I would maybe add knife moth as well to deepen out the edges a little bit and make it a little bit more ombre. But I wanna show you guys some of my favorite lipsticks and that I travel with without manipulating them and adding a lip liner. This is what they look like without a lip liner. Yeah, I really hope I look as good on camera as I feel because I feel so good right now. I feel so amazing. I need to start filming more um, makeup tutorials and videos like this because it makes me feel really good. Anyways, guys, this is a Rio and Madison from Anastasia. What do you think? Leave some comments down below and let me know which ones are your favorite. You're told everybody needs a red lipstick. Everybody needs a red lipstick. I don't care where you're from, what you do. You need a red lipstick. Surinama. I should hear Ben and you can't my video. She read that you a roll the lipstick no the hep. Nederland. Either in that Nederland product, the way that you a roll the lipstick no the hep. If you speak English, you know you need a red lipstick. I'm telling you, what other language can I say that you need a red lipstick? You have to roll the lipstick, no duh. You, you need a red lipstick in your collection. I don't know how to say it in Sranatongo. How do you say that? If anybody knows how to say you need a red lipstick in Sranatongo, leave it down below. If you speak Spanish and you know how to say you need a red lipstick, leave it down below. Whatever language you speak, Creole. Africans, whatever language you speak, leave a comment down below and let me know how to say you need a red lipstick. Period. All right. So the red lipstick I like to travel with is actually from a company called The Bomb. And this one is in shade Loyal. The reason why I like this liquid lipstick and I just started using it is because they're not super drying. You know what I mean? I, I always talk about this. I don't like super drying lipsticks, okay? I understand liquid lipstick is the new thing right now, but I'm sorry. I'm still not a huge fan of liquid lipsticks unless they're not super drying, okay? So let us let me show you what this one looks like without a lip liner. It smells like Smells a little minty. It smells a lot minty. I mean, it's 
just gorgeous, guys. This hair is so fabulous. This is a wig, by the way. It's the curly wig from, it's the lace front, it's the lace, I don't know if it's the lace, it's not the lace frontal because it's only, the lace closure is the right hair front of this all the way around. But this is the curly wig from Sway Hair, guys. It was a lot longer, but I cut it. Okay, so this is Loyal from The Bomb. I'm telling you, you need a red lipstick in your collection. It's like one of those things that just makes sense. Okay, let's say you are coming from work and your co-workers are like, let's go out for drinks, right? A quick way, I always have lipstick on my teeth, guys. That's another thing too, when you're wearing lipsticks, always check your teeth make sure that you don't have any lipstick on your teeth i'm telling you it kills the whole look like lipstick on somebody's teeth kills the whole look so always double check for that a quick easy tip to take your finger clean finger i hope put it in your mouth and pull it out and that's going to help lipstick from showing up on your teeth anyways back to this story right scenario i mean so let's say your friends invite you out for dinner or for drinks after work right and you want to go but you don't want to go looking the same if you just have a red lipstick in your collection or in your purse it changes up the whole look okay you go from work time to play time in a matter of minutes i'm telling you you have a roll the lipstick nude, okay? All right, so this is called Lawyer from the Bomb. Let's move on. I have one more lipstick to show you that I always travel with. It's just, it's just a surprise, okay? And I get a lot of compliments on the next lipstick I'm gonna show you. And this is the final liquid lipstick that I always, always travel with. Look, look at this. Uh uh, uh uh. This lipstick literally, guys, when I walk down the street and I have a full beat, my eyes will be a lot lighter than this. I'll pretty much have like no eyeshadow on, but I will definitely have on lashes. Yeah, I don't play about my lashes. I must have lashes. But this lipstick right here is such a showstopper. I can't even explain to you how many compliments I get. This one is called Paint by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I don't wear it often, I really don't, but when I do, Oh yes, I kills the game, okay? These are the lipsticks that are always in my purse. They are always with me. They're my babies. I will leave all the names of them down below. And you know what? Leave me some comments and let me know what are some lipsticks and lip glosses that you absolutely need with you every time you go somewhere, okay? Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below, you know, let's interact with each other. And then don't forget to subscribe. And just to be on the safe side, please turn on your notifications, guys. So that way you'll be notified every time I upload a video. I can't say this enough, guys. I have almost 70,000 subscribers here on YouTube. And my views are like... So I'm trying to fix that, all right? So turn those notifications on so you can come back and watch all of my videos. I love you guys so much. I appreciate all your support. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.